November 22nd and I'm just out in these streets. I had to come get my car serviced and I got a, I got some running around to do. Um, I have to work 12 hours tomorrow and y'all know Thanksgiving Thursday so. And then I have to take some stuff back to Target. I have to return a dress back that I did not wear for this wedding this past weekend. Honey, it was like below 60 and the dress that I purchased to wear to my friend's wedding was $100 and the back was out. And I'm like, mm, honey, it's less than 60 degrees outside and ain't nobody gonna see your back. So, I went to Target last minute and purchased like two dresses. One of the dresses was really cute and I ended up wearing it. Um, and I ended up being warm because one thing about me, I don't like to be cold, honey. I'm one of them low iron friends, baby, I don't like to be cold. So, I improvised and ended up wearing um, something that I had purchased from Target and just some stuff that I had around the house. <clears throat> in my closet i shopped my closet and saved a coin so i do need to return this dress because i don't see me wearing this dress any other time i did purchase it for the wedding because i was just like i don't get invited to many weddings not that <laughs> i'm trying to get invited to many weddings so i really don't have any formal attire to wear to places like that to events like that so Hmm, honey, run me my hundred dollars back, please, immediately. Thank you. Well, are y'all doing any Black Friday shopping? There's one main thing on my list, and if y'all been watching my channel, then y'all know what I need. I feel like it's it's a necessity at this point. It's not a want anymore. It's an it's a necessity. So <laughs> it's an essential item that I need immediately. that came to my head and I was just just randomly came to my head because I was just thinking about something but listen listen to what I gotta say can I go because it's my turn okay all right you can't change people you can't change their perception of you you can't change people so it is what it is the best advice that I can give you as a 40 year old is let it go. Let it go. Let go. And let God. I'm sorry. And I'm at this point in my life, baby. <laughs> I don't know what what you got going on. I don't I don't care because I got my own situation over here going on. And I'm at a point in my life where I ain't got time to be figuring out or trying to decipher why people feel a certain way about me. I'm sorry. I don't know why you feel the way you feel, but honey, whenever you come to your senses and get your forgiving heart, there'll be a seat at my table and we can talk. But other than that, baby, I I can't mm -mm, let go and let God. It's, it's, it's too many other things on my plate for me to be, for one, I can't keep these hazard lights from coming on and trying to hold his phone. So let me, <laughs> let me go in this though. Oh, you about to say it. Rosie, say hi.
y'all I forgot what I had I was saying but anyways my daughter friend made me a seafood boil a seafood bowl I think that's what she she made me a spicy bowl, y'all. Zakaya made me a spicy bowl. Oh, yes. Thank you. So I go warm it up in the microwave? Uh-uh. No? Don't warm, no, don't warm it up in the microwave. Just heat, eat it dry? I mean, cold? <laughs> I don't eat mine cold. I just leave it out on the counter before I eat it. Oh, okay. You need to eat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you later. Thank you. I'm going to make you some cupcakes. I was rudely interrupted anyways I was sitting at my I was sitting at my appointment and I saw this lady walking towards me she was an older lady she had her rolling walker and she was looking at me and coming directly towards me so naturally my first instinct was to think maybe she's lost maybe she needs some help so I was prepared to offer her some assistance she walked up to me and she says you look lovely my husband and I we saw you when you first walked in and you look so beautiful today I just want you to go out and have a lovely day I grabbed my heart because I was not expecting her that was not what I was expecting and it was just so kind and it just meant so much to me and I just want to share that with you guys I got up this morning and I remember now I was talking about my key fob not working and me, you know, <laughs> trying to work out at home, um, watching YouTube videos. And then I'm also in the gym as well. So just going to the gym yesterday and my fob not working, I'm just, I've gained some extra pounds and I don't know. I have just not been feeling myself. I don't like the way I look in the mirror. I feel like that was God saying that with all your imperfections, you're still perfectly made. And I thank God for that because I needed to hear that. I've been feeling like, oh, I've been feeling so fluffy. <laughs> and I've just been trying to cover it up with clothes and fashion. And I've just, you know, I can blame it on a lot of stuff. I can make a lot of excuses, but it starts with me. I need to work on myself. But that was just a reminder that for one, that I am perfectly made no matter how I look on the outside. I'm just the way God wants and intends for me to be. And I tell you, that was so worth it. I literally had to force myself to work out today. I've been working out for almost the last week. Just leaving the gym. What time is it? 9.15. I generally like to come between 5.30 and 6. Go ahead and get it out of the way and get my day started. It like helps me be productive if I start early. I'm still gonna be productive productive today but I like to get my day started oh I did not want to go I've been working out for the past week and today was one of those days where I did not want to get up and go but I kept talking to myself I was like no you're gonna get up and you're gonna go they're gonna have me do this for like another two weeks so. We'll see what he say. You need chopstick. I know, I have some in the car. It's good in the car or on your lips? I mean, not in the car. Getting nowhere, yeah. If winter blows here, baby, I fear we gon' disappear. Do you even want me? Do you even worry that I'm gonna love somebody else? Do you think about me when you're feeling lonely? Bye.
you guys i am gonna go ahead and end out this vlog child ain't nothing going on so let me stop dragging this on out i will see y'all in the next video if you're not subscribed please consider doing so like comment all of the things and i will see you guys in my next video